Okay, this is an interesting one. Who are the three most influential anglers you have met and why? Uh, yeah, that's an interesting question. That's a good question, that. Um, Terry Walton. Okay. And the reason why is um, when I was um, about 12, he was the match star in, in, in our kind of pub match team up in Derbyshire. And he really took the time to show us kids how to do things. You know, certainly show, showed me everything from, uh, you know, how to shot floats properly, you know, fish on the drop, understand fresh bait, understand, understand the real dynamic of, of being unobtrusive as well, you know, the scale down to catch more yeah. fish. So he, he will always sit there as a, a serious influence. Strangely enough, Nobody in my family, other than me, really fishes to kind of this kind of obsessional level. So um, outside influences have, have been pretty much, not, they're not kind of the famous anglers, if that makes sense. You know, um, Tony Miles, yeah. very good friend, and unfortunately he died last year. Um, he fished with me for 11 years, and the man had an incredible, very incre humble man, but very incredible consistency of catching. And we used to talk a lot together about bait and things like that. So he definitely influences me. Um, and on the bait, I mean, there's, there's you know, one guy I can pick out, um, Baldy Dave. I mean, he used to, he was with me at Pallington when we started the, the Palatrax, the company. He was very much alongside me and his history of um, bait making for his own passion, his own, uh, you know, people like that. Uh, and I learned a lot of him, a lot of the the factors that you need to use the highly nutritional value ingredients, yeah, yeah. how to prepare it best, how to, there was no commercialization of the bait he was making. And I'd like to say that, you know, that's been the continual flow of me. It's not a monetary thing. It's about making a really good bait. So there's three people that, you know, spring to mind yeah. as you answer that question, but there's, there's others, you know, there's a lot of others, but they're just normal like us. They're just anglers who have helped me along the way, you know, especially in sea fishing, you know, and fly fishing, you know, all these different people, some unfortunately who just have gone yeah. in 51 years, they're not there anymore, but they will always be there because of that influence.